Karen Kress is the Director of Transportation and Urban Planning at the Downtown Tampa Partnership and she learned about the bicycle friendly business concept a few years ago and really thought it would be a great fit for Tampa. Downtown Tampa surprisingly is a great place to ride a bicycle which might be a little counterintuitive because there's a lot of traffic and activity around but that's exactly precisely the reason why it does make sense to bike downtown because drivers are expecting to see people they're expecting to stop frequently um, we have opportunities to get away from cars for instance along the river walk if we can get you from one end downtown to the other um, or we have on street um, bike lanes and then sometimes streets are actually just kind of calm enough that you can just be right out there in the lane of traffic so as a way to kind of bring attention to that, draw attention to the fact that it is a very bikeable place. Um, one great way to uh, recognize that is through a bicycle friendly business program. This is something that hadn't been done in Tampa before, so we were able to make a big splash with our first phase. So we thankfully had a great partner in the Florida Department of Transportation who, who identified the need for this and was able to give us a little bit of funding for me to hire uh, a woman named Christina Costa with Pedal Power Promoters to go out there and really pound the pavement. And we weren't sure what to expect with our first phase, but as I, as I noted, it, it was really successful and uh, we are already working on phase two and we have a phase three plan so expect more great things from Tampa. Our main interest is in this was really economic development and community building and when you are on the seat of your bicycle you know seeing seeing your city from 10 miles an hour is a completely different experience so we really want people we want to give people you know a safe environment to come out and be biking by a store and say, I never noticed that before, and just hop off their bike. They don't have to deal with finding a car, a par, you know, place to park their car, and just, you know, just walk into a business. So we were able to identify those businesses who really wanted to kind of go above and beyond to attract those, those uh, people who are interested in seeing their city that way. And we, were able, we ended up, I think, 29 locally designated bike-friendly businesses. Tampa General Hospital is a 1,000 bed teaching hospital in downtown Tampa with over 7,000 employees. TGH is an economic powerhouse in the city, the region, and the state and is the only hospital in Florida to be certified silver as a bicycle friendly business by the League of American Bicyclists. Kim Christine is the employee wellness manager at Tampa General Hospital and she did a great job securing the award from the League of American Bicyclists. In the employee wellness team here, we are always looking for ways to help our employees to be healthier and happier and more productive. One of the things that we know about our um, employees is that many of them would like to bike to work. Some of them do but that sometimes it's a little bit difficult with some of the infrastructure we have or getting here. Um, so we were actually looking for ways to make biking a little bit more friendly here at Tampa General. So what we've done so far is we've created a number of access points for our employees so that when they get to work with their bikes, they have a nice safe place to park it. We also have other bike racks across the campus and at our corporate center. We're going to be building a new bike rack there for our corporate center employees. Our employees are our most important assets. We want them to be healthy. We know that there's a link between happy employees, healthy employees, productive employees, and the bottom line business results that come from that. And so I would tell employers it's really important to, to try and reach out for opportunities like this for your employees. Jessica Cohen lives close enough to the hospital to bike to work and she is one of the many individuals at Tampa General that has volunteered to be a bicycle ambassador and mentor to form bicycle clubs and coach others on riding their bike to work. So I've been riding almost two years in October. It's really convenient. You feel healthy. It's kind of my therapy after a long day. I get to be outside. I ride on Bayshore a little bit, so I get some of that nice view of the water. Um, I get great parking. I don't spend nearly as much money on gas. I don't put miles on my lease car. Um, so lots of good benefits. Always wear your helmet. And in the mornings, it's dark when I ride, so I make sure I have good lighting. I have uh, front light, back light. I even have some tire ones that when I feel like it's getting really dark in the early hours, I'll throw those on too. So be visible and be safe. When you're downtown in Tampa on your bike, look for this designation. These are businesses that have a special offering for you and want you as their customer. If you want to learn more about the Bicycle Friendly Business Program, 
contact me at 813-263-4785. I'm Christina Costa for Spotlight Tampa.